while I'm at work and nothing's going on. No orders, no nothing. Dead, dead, dead. 8.30 and it's dead. People don't want to eat. Alrighty, well, we'll see what the day brings. Hopefully it was better than yesterday. So I'm in Cresswell, there goes the train. By train, I'm glad it wasn't a long one. I'm glad it wasn't a long one. Look what we got today. Haven't tried this one yet. Ooh, hot sauce. Pop up power. Hopes it doesn't double the size down there. Ha ha. Well, I've been sitting for almost two hours and nothing popped up. No orders in the last two hours. I've done five for the day. <clears throat> Not a... Slow, slow, slow. We'll see what happens here. I'd like to get one more. It's like quarter to five now. <clears throat> I'd like to get one more. I'm just tired of sitting. Sometimes I go wander on in the store. Because <laughs> I'm just. Tired of sitting, figure I just better walk. I'm probably thinking like I've been walking enough, huh? <laughs> yeah, I just had another wrap. No snack, snacky poo. <clears throat> God bless you, this tree I'm parked under because it's, um, it's hotter than the Dickens again today. I'm just looking. What the hell is that? Oh, uh, no, something came off of that tree. I guess a, or a branch I hit the I hit the glass. Well, it's either that or Instacart don't like me. I'll turn you around to explain better. <clears throat> All right, so the star 4.92 that just dropped down today was 4.93 earlier. So as far as comments go, it's all like, yeah, see, five-star comments. I don't get a lot of comments. Oh, that cancellation rate was the other day. I did one, can I don't, I think I've canceled three times the entire time I've been with Instacart. <laughs> yeah, because Babe's had an appointment, so I canceled and then went. It was a last-minute thing. 63, yeah, that's about average. I've got it down to 57. So, you see here, nine, yeah, a couple of four stars, and then some of these were removed. Low stock, lowest range is bullshit. How can it be low stock? I don't own the store, I'm just a shopper. People think. People and people ask, "Oh, what you, what you guys got? How come you guys don't have this in the store?" I'm like, "I don't own the store. I'm just a shopper." Yeah, so people are trying. The customers try and get away with giving shoppers bad ratings so that they can 
get perks out of Instagram, I mean, Instacart. You know, kind of like with Uber. Uber customers will give you like one, two star so they can go back to Uber and say, hey, I had a bad experience. And then Uber is like, okay, I'll give you like a so many dollar credit or whatever it is for your next ride. Part of the same, no, no confirmation, but part of the same crap that's going on here with Instacart. <clears throat> it's like, you know, we usually take 50, oh, okay, I thought it was 100, but anyways, let me turn you back around. So yeah, it's part of the same thing, like how the ride shares go. I'm sure Instacart gives their customers perks for bad shopper experience. You know, I don't... But the thing is, <clears throat> it's anonymous... Oh, sorry. The thing is, it's anonymous... Yeah, ratings. So you don't know which customer is giving you lower ratings. Which is sad. And when they give you a lower rating, lower than five star rating, they're supposed to, <clears throat> they're supposed to state what it's for. Like this one, like the one I showed you before, like the low stock, like shit is out of stock. You know what I mean? When things are out of stock, things are out of stock. The store only has so much stockers. Not stalkers, people that stalk the shells. See, I gotta correct myself for you, for you guys, for you guys that are politically correct. You know, that deals with your PC crap. <clears throat> and then this other one here is lowest rating. Uh, that's not even a. That's not even like a. What do you want to call it? an excuse what else? oh and then this one here says here's another one <clears throat> I guess one of the last that, that's been there a while for finding items it says you did not find every item no I did not find every item because some was out of stock if you went back <clears throat> and checked your order, your list, there's things that are out of stock. So yeah, you're not going to get every item that's out of, especially if they're out of stock. It just customers just blow my mind. You know, they're just they're probably home in the recliner. Or water in the garden, put the order in, and I'm shopping for them. A lot of people are just ungrateful. But what to do? You just keep on trucking, or in this case, keep on shopping. Yep. Just keep on going because it's not no use whining and complaining over something you can't control because I, I'm just a shopper like I've been working off of apps for years now it was Uber, Lyft, Rody, now Instacart that's four. I thought it was the fifth one. Mm, no. It was four. So I've been driving. I've put these on driver apps. So these are driving apps. Uber, Lyft, Rody, Instacart. You can't control none of them. You absolutely can't do nothing about it.
So yeah, anyhow, nothing, nothing, nothing. Absolutely nothing is being posted. If nothing is happening in a while, time to go home. I already made my daily quarter, but still. It just sucks to be sitting around for two freaking hours. I guess I'm stuck on my tooth. I think it was one of the tortilla wrap. It's a soft wrap, like a burrito wrap. When I got it out, god damn. So yeah. So so I'm trying to make transition over to Poshmark. So I gotta catch. I gotta catch up on my bills. And then I'm gonna order some stuff. Start out small. I'm still gonna be doing Instacart. Every now and then I look at the roadie app for see if there's like big ones like long hauls. I had a long haul out of Independence yesterday, 800 miles one way. So there'll be a 1600 mile trip from Independence. That's excluding Eugene to Independence, which is just right up the road. So 16, probably round trip 16, 50 maybe, anyhow. I just did a 1600, 800 from Independence back for easy math, but they're only willing to pay $300 for an 800 mile road trip. Uh, I mean, if I was going that way and staying over there, uh, yeah. But I gotta come back here, so no. <laughs> what is that, 19 cents a mile? Yeah. 19 cents a mile, and right now gas is $26 a tank. Yeah. So yeah, back to Poshmark. Um, so transitioning over to Poshmark, I gotta buy wholesale. A lot of people just thrift. You go to like the outlet stores uh, or do RA retail arbitrage and try and resell it. You know, you go to like flea markets or thrift stores and like Goodwill outlet has those bins or you know, whatever. But with the Rona, I really don't want to be digging through people's used shit. I don't, don't want to be rewashing. Neither, even though they, the store might have rewashed them, but I don't want to wash them when I go home. So, just for easiness for the shit to come to me, I shouldn't say shit, for the merchandise to come to me, I'll buy the products online, you ship to the house, repackage them, and ship them back out when they're ordered. So, that's the easiest way. And it's probably going to save me a lot of money too, got gas and my time. Because I could place the order online and still do Instacart. I'm not taking the time, the day off, to go look for mer merchandise to resell. So yeah, that's that. So once I, once we can get the... So Babe's going to do it with me. So once we can get the... My idea is to have my income replaced with Poshmark from Instacart. So, 
that's not probably not gonna happen overnight probably gonna take a while we'll see still learning the Poshmark app thingy but I'm so following people every day people follow me every day I'm probably following like 5,000 people a day and I think I'm getting like 1600 back a day 1500 back but you gotta watch who you not really who you follow because if you just go down the line go click 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 and not look at the names you gotta pay attention to the names because there's a lot of bots with fake accounts yeah sure it's good to have a lot of followers but if there are fake accounts then they're useless to you so I do my best to catch those and I follow them and like oh crap I go back and unfollow them because they're, they're no one managing them <laughs> oh yeah okay what the heck yeah there you go yeah, bots on Instacart are still happening it just blinked a $45 or $47 one whatever it is it just blinked yeah it just flash it just flash and it's done yeah it's not as bad as what it used to but it's still they still need to deactivate those people that use the bots cutting into my profit man Alrighty, well, I'm gonna. I'm not sure if I'm gonna film dinner. I'm not. I think we'll get. We'll pronounce it chilaquila. I made Babes laugh the other day when she pronounced it to me. So I said, "What? Chili killers? Chili killers? Yeah, she cracks up with my Spanish pronunciations. So, um, so I'll, I'll maybe we'll see what happens, see what's going on for dinner, whether I film it or not. But anyhow, if I don't film it, I'll holler at you in the morning. Ciao.